know, the Dolphin County area and surrounding areas, um, a pass through for trafficking, but it also becomes a destination to recruit victims. From our train stations to our airport, our turnpike to major roads like Route 15, Central PA is a hub for transportation, and that puts us on the map for sex trafficking. Now look at this map behind me. It shows human trafficking hotspots across the entire country, and this is central Pennsylvania. Tonight, we're focusing on sex trafficking in our neighborhoods. So let me break down the numbers nationally. Of the 16,658 victims of trafficking identified, nearly 11,000 are sex trafficked. And while escort services top this list, pornography and massage parlors are not far behind, and they're all forms of modern day slavery. Tonight, a local woman is sharing her terrifying story. This is Nikki. I woke up, they were gone, and there was a black dude in my room with a gun, beat me with a pistol, raped me, and told me I was his. Locked inside a hotel room like a crated dog, Nicole Walliver says she was held at gunpoint while countless men paid her sex trafficker to rape her. What repulsed me the most was the men that came in. Like, here you got a girl that's bawling her eyes out, busted up, bleeding, got a black eye, a busted lip, and you're able to just perform sexually. It would be two and a half weeks before Nikki says she escaped her captor. In walks in this white dude. He was young, and by the looks of him, like, it sounds bad, but the kid looked more nervous than I was already nervous and scared for the situation. And he had told my trafficker, he was like, Dude, I don't feel comfortable with you standing in this room. Why do anything while you have a gun in your hand? And he was like, I'll pay you extra if you leave the room. The trafficker left, and I looked at the kid, and I said, thank you, and I ran. Nikki was 600 miles away from her home in Harrisburg. She says she and two others traveled to South Carolina to make fast money at strip clubs. The couple she was with took off in the middle of the night. Nikki was, had no problems with dancing. She loved dancing. And then all of a sudden, she ends up in a situation that's scary and it's dangerous. And she's not the only one that's ended up in those situations. Patty Seaman is the executive director of an organization called Peace Promise. She's also a pastor. Patty builds relationships with women like Nikki who work in the commercial sex industry. We want them to know that they're loved, they're valued, and if they need anything, we're right there to help them. Route 15 puts Central PA on the map for trafficking. It's a hub for transportation running right through Pennsylvania from Maryland to New York. Central PA, there's a lot of local women who end up in a situation where they're being trafficked or they're being exploited against their will. With Nikki's story, obviously it's very violent. Is that often the case? The commercial sex industry and violence go hand in hand. So it's an active area for prostitution. And a lot of trafficking victims come right through this area and people never know about it. Have you lost any friends to the sex industry? Has anyone died? Yes. A couple. I was always a promiscuous and flirtatious girl who lacked self-respect. Nikki has started a new chapter in life. Which then sparked me into wanting to change my life around and the view I had on it. She completed a program at a safe house where she put herself through school and she's now managing a hair salon. How do you keep yourself out of that scene? I remember what I went through. Nikki's trafficker was never caught. January is National Human Trafficking Prevention Month, and one way to prevent it is to bring awareness to the problem. So I leave you with this quote from William Wilberforce, a leader of the movement to abolish slave trade. You can choose to look the other way, but you can never again say you did not know. And if you'd like to learn more about Peace Promise, whether you need their help or you want to help, call the number on your screen, 717-686-9160.